Hello there, Warm, and welcome to Dungeon Keeper 2. We're picking up from where we played off last week on Dungeon Keeper 1, so we're going to give Dungeon Keeper 2 a go. I've heard this is the better, the better game, so this is like the sequel. There's a little thing here. If we go to... not options. This is the options menu. When you click something, you sort of zoom into it, and you zoom back out. There's nothing really in them. Archways to indicate it's options or anything, but it, it does it. Look, this is the extras panel, right? DK3 trailer, guys. There's a Dungeon Keeper 3 trailer here. It's included in Dungeon Keeper 2 now. Dungeon Keeper 3 never came out, so how they got a trailer in there, I don't know. Maybe maybe the pro pro project was cancelled. I don't know the, the full uh, details of it, but I'm sure you could watch the trailer on YouTube if you wanted to. We're going to play the single player campaign and see if it's just as funny and as good as the original ones when we played the first three levels, so let's give it a bash. So we're going to play a new campaign. Ah, this looks familiar. So we're like, we're like, on a, like a top down board, we're in like a, like, oh, it's like a hall room, maybe a dungeon, I don't really know what we're in. Let's click it and find out. Smiles, Will. Welcome, Keeper. Before you lies a happy and carefree realm. The local champion, Lord Antonius, holds the first portal gem you require. Learn how to construct a dungeon and build up your forces so that you can crush Lord Antonius and wipe the smile from his face. Okay, so we've got to kill... I've got to, well, actually, they've got to assault and kill Lord Antonius. And the sub-objective is to build a 5x3 lair and a 3x3 hatchery. They sound familiar. I think we got them last time. We had the same guy speaking to us in the ear there. Now, he wasn't very loud because I have the volume turned down for you guys. So if you couldn't hear him, I'm sorry. But that's just to make it so the game audio doesn't destroy you in-game. I'll make that better on YouTube, I'm sure. I think I'm going to need to blow my nose at some point. Your Ooh, dungeon heart. Cinematics. Protect it well. For if it is destroyed, you will be banished forever from this land. So protect the heart. Here walks the goodly Lord Antonius. Tis he who holds the precious portal gem. But only when you've mustered strength sufficient should you challenge him and claim your prize. So is he just like roaming around in the dungeon himself? And apparently we've got to get these portal gems, which we saw in the intro. Leia. Okay. Actually. What? Right, this interface is different compared to what the previous one was. Money to be made. Click on the flashing seam of gold. It's a tutorial. Your imps will dig out the area you designate. Can we well increase done. his volume? And now your faithful servant imps will carry back your gold to Dungeon Heart. Probably not. Once here, it can be spent. The golden scale atop the screen keeps track of your reserves. All right. A start indeed, but more gold is required. Twelve thousand oh. units should be mine. Oh, what? I think it just heard. It. I think it just heard someone. Ah, hey, what's going on here? What's going on? It's Zach. Oh, hello. How are you doing? You've just joined me for Dungeon Keeper 2. I just saw you actually, Zach. What, what were you streaming for so late for? Is it because you couldn't complete that level and it was it was getting to you, Zach? Is that what it was? You come to watch a real player play a game? Ah, I feel you, Zach. I feel you. Red flowers float above your imps. The symbol. I recognize all you guys. I recognize all you guys. But I can't hear what this guy's saying to me now, so let's have a listen. Let's have a listen. Observe. Red flowers float above your imps. These give measure to their health, their skill acquired. What? I feel like I haven't learned enough from the previous game to be given all this new information, so. You are ready to recruit more creatures to your cause. See? A portal near your dungeon heart to where your imps must dig. They'll claim this portal. Right, so that's the portal where the creatures come out of, guys. I wasn't. I wasn't prepared for. A, I wasn't prepared for an influx of people. I wasn't prepared for an influx of people. I would have drank more whiskey if this was the case, guys. If you should have gave me a heads up, I would. I would have drank some more whiskey to be prepared and get a bit more charismatic. You join me at the beginning of Dungeon Keeper uh, Two, the tutorial, uh, basically it is. And we just played Dungeon Keeper One last week, which I was just saying before. And we learned the basics of Dungeon Keeper 1. I was thinking, I really enjoyed Dungeon Keeper 1, so we're playing Dungeon Keeper 2 to see if it's better. We heard the sequel was better. So we're giving this one a bash. And it looks very similar. The graphics look better, more improved. Uh, but the interface is different. The the the, the, U, the UI is on the bottom as opposed to the left. Behold your portal. 
and I can't hear this guy. Which new creatures enter your domain? I better hear him. Forth to use the rooms which you provide. Okay. Behold! Look oh, well. here we go. A goblin has entered your domain. On his own, he is a cowardly beast, but in a horde becomes a useful fighting force. <laughs> we just spent five hours watching Zack do one level in Themos, so which relates to one Dr. Whitman. You know, uh, I think James is in this chat. Yeah, J James is in this chat right now, and Jim <laughs> James told me something funny about, dungeon uh, about Theme Hospital. And about with the actual British and the English NHS. What's what, what's this want me to do? Build your port. Behold, yeah, I've done this. Okay, he wants me to just build over here. Okay, now this flashing is giving me like some form of epilepsy here. Come on. Yes. All right. I think he said to build here. Let's read this. Look, look well. Your goblins need a lair where they shall sleep. Okay, so this is to make our lair. Okay, so our goblins are. Ch Can we slap them? Slap. Yes. We can slap them, guys, and make them work faster. Although, I can't zoom with the mouse button for some reason, which is odd. Yeah, there was something about the NHS and the complaint about uh, Theme Hospital. Oh, no! They use Theme Hospital to, to train... Uh, was it students? Medical students? About... Uh, about I guess about medicine in, in the in the hospitals in England and stuff and apparently uh, drop him, right -click it worked and I guess that would make sense for your five hours waiting time so the NHS is great and everything but you don't get seen overly quick unless you're dying good now build good now okay so this is our building panel guys oh the layer is actually a bed I can actually see these like so the hatchery is like a, a hen and the layer okay. All oh, right. Okay. This is different. You can actually drag. Remember, you can drag the building. Constructions cost you gold. That was quick. That was magical. Your layer is built. That was magical. Now right click to cancel building mode. Oh, Johnny Black. Nice. I'm drinking uh, Valentines. Just the common Valentines. I'm a common man. I haven't got the view count like Zach. I can't afford the good the good whiskey. Let's have a look. Your goblins arrested. All right, my goblins are arrested. Dig out the flashing area. Oh, okay. All right. So I'm learning these new mechanics in God in uh, Dungeon Keeper Two. So in Dungeon Keeper One, you've got to just you can only go like in like single line of uh, the squares. But here you can actually make a big square and highlight it all, which is pretty cool. So okay, this must be a land you can't build on, which I like. So we need a hatchery now, I think. So the, what did it say that thing was above him mean? The objective here, build a 5x3 then a 3x3 three three hatchery. This must be the hatchery we're going to build now, okay? And if I just drag, like this, yeah, there we go. Go on, work quicker. Come on, guys. It's too slow for me, it's too slow. I have 6,900 gold. Are they building here? Oh no, they've got, okay, I've got to wait for them to claim the territory first. And then I can the build my hatchery. There we go. Okay, magic. The hatchery you've built provides some food, but not enough. An area three by three or more is what's required. That is. All right, I'm trying to. Come on. Are they building it here? What? Did I just build a lair? I built a lair. How do I how do I destruct? What's this one? Options? I built a lair instead of a hatchery. Can I build on top of it? We're under attack by whatever they are. Now, can you possess people in this game like you could in the other one? I can't hear this guy. His voice is too quiet. We've got him on max volume and I can't hear a thing he's saying. And I can't destruct my building. Observe the white health flowers which appear above them. Oh. When they're near to death, you'll see that only right, let's just... Oh, I've ruined it, you know, I've ruined it by building the... Okay, we can do it like here. If I do this, do a 3x3 three three here, and we'll build a new hatchery here, okay? There's a, a dollar symbol next to the minimap. Oh. Ah, sell! I got, okay, I sell online. I got gold back. All oh, right, nice. All right, cool. Nice. Nice. Thanks, guys. Good 
progress. You know, you know what that means, guys. It's because you guys have come here from Zach's stream, and now you can help me play the damn game. <laughs> Mm, in. Soon now. But very soon, more goblins oh, what's going on? I can, I can hear things. What's going on? Will be strong enough to I think someone just subscribed. Them. Does it say so? Rav Book. Oh. Thanks for the subscription, Rav Book. And I think I heard some uh, followers and stuff. It's funny, I just made these Twitch alerts, like, on Tuesday. I made these new Twitch alerts, and now they're actually coming through, like, for the first time. And another one. I can hear the wild going off. And ironically, people are... Uh, not ironically, that's the terrible use of the word, ironically. But people who who don't aren't familiar with poppies at the beginning won't know what them Twitch alerts mean. Right, let's get another hatchery, because why not? Oh, look how quick it is. Right, that's a lot quicker. Five by three layer. Is that by five by three? It is, yeah. Okay, we've got our obje secondary objectives done. We now need to, I uh, guess, is there a map? Yes, we've got a mini map. M key by any chance? Ah, nice, look at me. I know all the hotkeys. There's some more gold up here, I think that is. But basically now we just need to assault the guy. Can we find the guy? Can I rotate the camera? I don't know how. Right, well, we may as well get this gold. Is there a bit more gold here? Yeah, there is. Okay, nice. Nice, nice, nice. Can anyone... Oh, wait. There we go. Yeah, I was already going there. He must be hiding here, Lord Antonius. Let's get this one out. Where's our goblin out? We can pick them up, bring them here, and then slap them. And he should do that quick. Let's stop this for now. We've got a lot going on here. We've got a war going on. Alright, so these are my people here. Away, oh shit. You shall not take smiles there with your evil ways. He speaks. The feeble Lord Antonio. See how the petals of his white house flower. What the get up? He's marching down with your path. Come on, guys, hit him. Hit him quicker. I don't think I could zoom in on the last one. Where's my uh, research panel? Is there a research panel? No. He speaks the feeble Lord Antonius. See how his petals of his white, white health flower are of special shape? This marks him down as your prime target. Okay. He's dead. We got him. We got him, guys. Paula gem lies aside his helpless form. Okay. Right, we did the first level. Right. We're just getting used to the game again. Press space to proceed. Is that me? Alright, pretty nice. Let's press space to proceed. Press space to go to the debriefing screen or escape the coin. Oh, let's have a look at the debrief. Uh, debrief. Debrief. Fucking whiskey's got to me already. Okay. Well done, Keeper. You have successfully ended the life of Lord Antonius, and you have claimed your first portal gem as well. This is a most promising start. Don't slap them in combat, it hurts them. Does it not make them hit them quicker? I don't know. I, I hope there's no more, uh, hope more cinematics like that, because my wife will be home very soon. And if she sees me watching Devilly, Devilly Women, she'll, uh, she'll get the wrong idea. All right, we came sixth in score-wise. Now we need a name, and last last week we did this. We, we I left it to you guys to come up with a name for the top score. So, anyone got an idea what we could do? Uh, what our top score or name could be here? I I'm certainly not PG only, guys. So if you want to come up with something smutty, that's fine. Uh, could be oh, could be hot lips. We could maybe call that hot lips. I'll, I'll see what you guys say. Let me try. Yo, I already missed a secret. No. Oh. Yeah, I missed the secrets in the tutorial. Let me check here and see what's going on. Right. Gamerzak is raiding with a party of 55. Okay, that's a lot of people. <laughs> okay, hello to everyone. I didn't I didn't see all the hellos because they just scrolled down so quick. And I don't have a second monitor. I only have my mobile to look at the chat. So we're playing on like a really old laptop. This is why things like Dungeon Keeper. And pop this at the beginning now, all we can really play because my computer can't run much else. Boat lover, right, Titanic, you win straight away. Nobody is gonna know what it means. But that's that's for us to know, guys. That's for us to know. Okay, we're gonna push on to the second level. I like this. I feel like we're in like a war room. Sing song. 
a joyous land filled with light and music. Let us silence their wailing voices once and for all. This land is defended by Lord Darius, a far tougher opponent than Lord Antonius. Only by harnessing the forces of dark magic will you defeat him. Mm. Build a library to attract warlocks to your cause. All right. And they will reveal. To so this is where we get introduced to the library and the warlocks and the creature room, training room thing again. Invade Lord Darius's keep and slay him. Is that one of the like wizards we saw in the, the, in the cinematic? Oh, here we go. Well, maybe I will. Maybe I will. It's a good employ. Library. Training room. Right. Okay. First, build a lair, and then a hatchery. Then claim the portal near your dungeon. Right, one second, guys. Is there a pause button? There's not. Is that paused? Okay, one moment, guys. I really need to blow my nose. You guys would would raid me on a day when I'm like, my setup's all wrong, my microphone's broken, my game was broken. I'm sat in a different place, my my daughter's high chairs behind me and things, the, the background's not overly great, but Thanks, Zach. Very appreciated to get raided. Like I didn't even know that was a thing. Raided? Not raided. Is that where you just do you just force your people over to another another uh, channel or something? Not sure. Let's have a look at this level then, shall we? Okay, so layer first and layer was it optimal five by three? Did he say? Let's give it a go there anyway. And hatchery, he wanted a three by three. What's this here? I didn't put that there. I didn't do that. Should have kept it though, because that's what we're doing. And there's some gold here, so we'll need the gold. I guess, can we get treasure rooms? Or did they just instantly store the treasure in this game and, and just keep it too? Library, training room. There's no treasure room in this game. I didn't click on all this. Oh, it's cost my. Hang on, let me disable my touchpad. Because I'm touching it with my, uh, with my arm here, trying to touch all the hotkeys. And can I create more men in this game? Uh, maybe this is the... Is this like a research panel? Display keep a spells panel. Left and shift, shift click for permanent display. Okay. Come on, guys. Speed it up. Right, this is our lair. So we get our lair down first. And that one just... They just come down easy. So the goblins don't have to build buildings. They just have to claim the territory. Your creatures need space here to rest and recuperate. So that's what the lair does. Because I didn't even know what they do. Now the hatchery breeds fresh juicy food to sit uh, to sit your minions' appetites. Okay. And the library. Academics may research and improve spells in this study room. Right. Okay. Well, let's get to our... Are oh, they taking the goal back. That's good. We can build our hatchery now. We'll go for a 3x3 three three hatchery. Is that 3x3? Three three? That's, no, that's not 3x3, three three, Craig. That's like 2. Mass is not my strong point. <laughs> right, can we pick a goblin up? Oh no, they're going to do it here. They're going to do it. Okay. So we've got some gold here. There's gold there. And we can make a path this way to this gold. Now, I don't know if the, if you need a treasure room, guys. Because I mean, obviously isn't isn't one to build, but... If you can, you just store gold here to an unlimited amount. I don't really know. Hatchery here. Right, library. Where can we build a library? Is this? Can you? Can I build in this? I think so. Yeah. So we're taking over the portal now. This room is owned by another power. Its details are unknown. Okay, that guy must be doing whatever. There we go. You've claimed a portal. Now clicking this takes me to the portal. Clicking this accepts the message, and clicking this deletes the message. Okay. Review objective. Build a library and use the warlocks. Yeah. Well, now, I, I, you said I missed, a, I missed a treasure. I missed a secret in the last level. Is there any secrets in this level I should be aware of? A new species of creature has entered your dungeon. Your dungeon hack can store up to 16k. You've got the treasure room in the next level. Okay. Thank you very much, John. Design it square to maximize the space for scrub. And let your imps make stronger walls to hold more shade. Alright. New species of creatures in your dungeon. Where's he at? 
We've got a goblin. We've got another goblin, guys. The basics of your dungeon are in place, but now expand it with a library. Design it square to maximize the space for scrolls, and now you must make strong walls to hold more shelves. Okay, so if you reinforce the walls, you get to hold shelves as well. Right, so really, we don't need to be getting this gold right now if we can't hold any more. If I can fly. If we can't hold any more in our base, so in our heart. So let's just go for the, the library here. Yeah, can I do that? Now I'm sure I could rotate. Let's try something. Dark oh shit. Man. A warlock has arrived to study spells within your library. His research will serve your magic well. Restrict him not though to his books, for when in battle he may prove formidable with fireball. With fireballs, eh? Let's see if I can actually rotate. Yes, I can rotate. So it's control and to zoom in. Alright. Hang on, let me just position this better. Every bookcase in my library will attract another warlock to my realm. Right. Now, I'm getting used to get. Oh, right, I can zoom in and out like this. I can scroll like this. And we move around like this. Okay, it's like populous the beginning controls. But I'm not used to using them controls because I have my own hotkeys for that game. So, right. Go around this way, rebuild our. expand our library. Right. It's best to make it square. Man. And four by four. I think we've managed it just, guys. Build it here as well, get entrances. Now, actually, I remember in the previous game it said that the library needs to be quiet. This isn't a library, it's a lair anyway, but if the library is like away from places, it works better because they need quiet. There's no music, guys. Where's the music? What a shame. There's no music. I have to add it in a YouTube post. But for you guys, there's no music. Even though, like, when I was testing the music volume, it did show the music off. So, I don't know. What can you do? What can you do? So, we're researching something here, guys. You can see here, this question mark's going, uh, like, a, like a, it's going around in circles. It's gonna, gonna, when it gets to the side, it's going to give us something. I don't know what I'm trying to say. I don't know what I'm trying to say. I can eat chickens. That must be the hatchery. Yeah. Oh look, they've actually got a little uh, chicken pen. A task well done. There we go. The training creatures will cost gold. Let's have a look. What are these doing down here? But training creatures will cost gold. Well, we better get the rest of this gold that we found. Look, <laughs> I'm trying to move and I'm holding it in. Okay. Okay. We'll get this here. Uh, we'll get this one here. Okay. These controls are not optimal. These are dated controls, guys. These are really dated. Okay. Oh, halfway there to the spell. I don't know what it is, guys. I don't know what it is. I turned the music off. What? I didn't turn the music off. Don't lie to me. Music on. Look. On. Right there. On. But if you play with it, you can hear it. Then you stop. It goes off. So there is music, like, in the game. But it only works when I click it. Like, if I click one of these, we'll get a different option. Yeah, you can hear different things in the voice. Feckin' fly. One, two. I don't know, man. I don't know. Oh. Oh. It doesn't tell me who followed, but thanks for the follow. I can hear the sound. That wildman, you've become a wildman. By following, you become a wild. If you follow on Twitch or you subscribe on YouTube, you're officially a wildman. And if you don't know, a wildman is from the game Populous Beginning, which is what my YouTube channel is all based on. Mostly. We're branching out a bit. Or should we say we're excavating out a bit by digging these dungeons? Right, now what? I think we've pretty much got what we need to do. I guess when the spell researches, it's going to tell us something else. So, is this land buildable? No. Okay. This dense stone is impenetrable and can never be dug out. Impenetrable uh, stone. Nothing worse when you come up with something that's impenetrable, you know what I mean, guys? No matter how much you try, they always say no. 
this stone stone. Okay, here we go, guys. New spell, guys. Here we go. We're waiting for it. New spell has been researched. Oh, mana, guys. Mana is the currency of magic, and this, uh, this you spend each time you cast a spell. Your mana level shown in green atop the screen. You reported in what? Your land, your land will gradually renew it as it's spent. Your land will gradually renew it as it's spent. And select the imp's head symbol. Oh, this is my manor up here. Alright. This would be a cool thing to see in, like, Poppy's beginning. You can see, like, your actual manor. One improves his skill to level two. A creature can train as high as level four, but that's the limit. Further skill can only be attained... Alright, so my guys are training here. Now someone's level two. They can go to level four in the training room, but to get any higher, they need to fight in combat. Now, we've got a spell here called Create Imp. This is what I was after, guys. Now we can create a ton of imps. And the cost should go up. Yeah, now it's 6,000 for one. Although... My gold isn't going down the more I'm casting them. Feckin'. Now it's 12 thousand. My gold hasn't gone down. Left click to grab. I don't know what's going on. A good cast keeper. You've made use of the good use of the warlock's studious researches. Okay, so we managed to create some... Imps are creatures born oh. of magic and cost mana to sustain. Imps are creatures born of magic and cost mana to sustain. What are... All right. Okay. So the, we. You may wish all right. To train your warlocks to improve their skills. To do this, drop a warlock. Okay. So we train. drop a warlock in here. He'll stop researching, I imagine, and then they will train up. And we'll keep that one in there now because there's another research to get. Now our gold's going down, but we spent a ton of gold, and it wasn't going down. Is that because every time we spend some gold, they kept bringing it back into the heart? Is that what was happening? Damn it! it flies everywhere. More imps equals less your mana goes up. Right. So it's like the opposite of populace, where the more braves your mana goes up. The less braves your mana goes up. But here it's the more. Warlock. Name Kurt. Kurt the Warlock. Nimrod the Warlock. What's the other Warlock called? The one who's studying. That's an imp. Hang on, where's he at? Okay, he must have went to rest. There he is. Lothar there. Went out to rest. Now he's coming back. So we've got 14,000 gold, we've got 13,000 mana. Uh, our increase is higher than our, our... Well, our incoming is higher than our outgoing, so our mana is going up. I suppose you've got to balance that at some point. Let's check the map. Oh, there's something up here, guys. There's like some water and there's some gold there. Let's have a, let's have a cheeky dig. So if we go to the follow-up panel... Where's my... Can I not select my imps? Oh, here they are. Okay, these are my imps here on the left here, so which ones are... These are busy, these are idle, and that's my total, so okay. Your imps have found some dwarfs. These righteous little pests may stray onto your land, and if they do, destroy We found some dwarfs, okay. If I grab all my men here... A new spell has been researched. And just drag them down here, right? Come and defend the library, guys. Get up there. Offering you another spell to cast. Right, so I've got another spell as well. Thunderbolt. Right, I'm going to cast it. Oh, there we go. Shook, a bitch. <laughs> right, that wasn't very good, though. That was 6,000 gold. 6,000 mana. Allow your creatures time to rest and eat. When ready, guide them north to find Lord Darius's keep. Hey, the music's come on. Uh, hey, the music's on, guys. Right. Why are these lying down? I thought we killed them. Are they, are they dead? Because there's, there's something there that's going around. So what happens here? Do they die at that point or do they get back up? We're going to find out, aren't we? So we just got a message there. The pol... The pol... The pol how do you say that? Poultry? I think it's poultry. Or the pol nah, poultry. The poultry dwarves are now destroyed. Allow your creatures time to rest and eat. Creature picks it up. A right click on claimed land then lets it drop. Be wary though. Don't drop them too near enemies. For dropping stuns, then these beasts of time and makes them vulnerable to enemies. Okay, that makes sense because you drop them, they get stunned a bit. In the last game, that didn't happen. I was just dropping enemies right in front, uh, dropping creatures right in front of the enemies, and they just attack straight away. So, don't you keep it too? You can't do it right next to them, otherwise they just get spanked. Hey, what happened here? I didn't. It's... Christ, we've come across like a, a gold mine. Look at all this. How do you get across the water though? We don't need the gold. What's on the map? 
So I guess if we go f further up, did he, which way did he say to go? We've got to find Lord Darius. I will find him. I can't... Reinforced wall. Can I please build? No. Oh, I had the bloody spell clicked. Jesus. Let's go that way. What? There we go. Work faster, guys. Come on. Hop to it. Can you pick that guy up and chuck him down over here? Lord Darius's walls are breached. We found him. Now must kill his guards. Let's pick everyone up. Stir Lord Darius himself to come defend his kill the guards, and then Lord Darius himself will come. And if we cast a thunderbolt on them, we might do something. Another thunderbolt? No, can't. Won't let me. Thunderbolt? Yes? No? Apparently not. But these my men look like they're winning anyway. These guys have fell on the floor. Lord Lord Darius has arrived with a, with a, a few henchmen there. What are these dwarfs? He's got dwarfs working for him. Okay, we kill him again on the gem. And we advance to the next level. Okay, the power of good is going to drive us. From can we lighten them? Yes, we can now. He must be able to lighten them when he's in our turf. Yeah, you like that? And that? Yeah? Yeah. How about Lord Darius? Right, let's get the men. Pick the men up. You're going to be stunned briefly. Now Lord Darius is going to come across this way. They should get up now and attack. We can get another Thunderbolt. Although maybe... I don't even know how good Thunderbolt is. There we go, we hit him. Oh, we stunned him. It stuns them, does it? Oh, I think he's dead. Yeah, yeah. Combination of attacking him with fists and the stun killed him. So it kind of like with with these abilities, we hard have the ability to be like a bit of a shaman, similar to uh, pop this beginning, so we can cast spells and stuff. That guy's chuffed. That guy is chuffed. Any names for the for the high stall guys? Hit me with them now, while we see what this guy's going to do. Thunderbolt does little damage, but it also stuns them. Makes sense. You can only cast in your claim lands. See? I'm right. I've got some Dungeon Keeper 2 experts in the lobby here. Certain spells can only be cast on tiles you own. Alright, cool. My wife has just arrived home. The treasure lets you hold more guns. My wife's just arrived home. We're streaming earlier today because uh, Argentina's playing. They're playing right now. I'm in Argentina. And Argentina's playing against Croatia now. It's 40 minutes in. It's still nil-nil. So I'm going to miss the first half, but my wife's going to watch it. Uh, so you might hear some screaming or some, or some crying or whatever. So let's push on with the level. Let's push on with the level. Nunchaku. Robert Ashby. Yes. I see you blasted Lord Darius <laughs> of the face of the realm. A most entertaining way to claim a portal gem. To hear their singing turn to screaming has been a tremendous joy to my ears. Excellent. Level 1, yes. Time taken. 1439. Enemy creatures killed zero. What? I wish not. How did we not kill them? How do we win if we didn't kill anything? Specials found, zero out of one. Oh, I missed another special. Okay. They must be somewhere on the map. I guess you have to dig around and find these things. Oh, our, our score was terrible. Our score was terrible. Let's call ourselves Robert Ashby. It would have been so good if this game was narrated by Robert Ashby, but unfortunately it wasn't. Unfortunately it wasn't. But we'll call him Robert Ashby. We'll go to the third level now. I know it's running again. This is a peaceful land, but a poor one, since its defender, Lord Avaricious, has frittered away his riches. If you can amass enough gold, he will surely be tempted into leaving his fortress and attacking you personally. Build a workshop, and fill your realm with fiendish traps and doors to protect your hard-won treasuries. Alright. We can build sentry traps and wooden doors to defend the dungeon. We need to mine out all the gold in the land to entice the Lord out of his keep. Avaricious. Lord Avaricious to his grave. Lord Avaricious hides within his fortress. 
He's well defended, but gold is weakness. To lure him from his stronghold, mine all the gold within his realm. Okay. Treasury. So it's like shop. they live underground, guys. So they live underground now, because in the first game they, they came from above, they like dug underground, right? Oh look, at the top right here you've got like a the zoom view, that's really cool. Okay. So mine all the gold. Now have we got any buildings here already? We have the pod we've just got, we need to make a lair. Now I think a lair is the main thing, is it guys? I'm not 100%, but we're going to go for that. Go straight for the lair. And uh, next to the lair, can I go here? Fog of War. The swift knight fireflies essential as an airborne scout. His eyes are yours to penetrate dark places of the world. I guess that Your creatures require a place to rest. Right. Them a layer. So I guess we don't do it too quick because they've got to they, our aims have got to do stuff and then I guess we have to uh, claim the territory. So we can't just go build all of them up instantly and just try to be like micromanaging the game to the best of your ability. You've sort of got to wait like this guy is waiting. Now these guys are going to fortify the walls. Okay. This is our scout, apparently. Now he's over here now helping us uncover this fog of war. I guess he just goes around uncovering fog of war on his own. But I guess you, I guess you can pick him up as well and move him to somewhere you want to be scouted in particular. Which is an idea. You need to train and train your creatures, of course. Yes, I know. Thank you very much. I mean, the game's just started. It's telling me to do stuff already. And there goes our lair. Nice. 4,500 gold, of course. species of creature has entered your dungeon. What have we got? A goblin. Look, our goblin has entered the dungeon, guys. We've still got no music. We had the music for like a second in the last level. <laughs> To be fair, the music, the, mu the soundtracks of uh, Dungeon Keeper 2, because I've, I've used them in popular uh, campaigns before, like 20 minutes long per each track or something. Okay, a workshop should be built so trolls, trolls, trolls will come and use it for their fabrication, benefiting you with traps and doors to help defend your underground creation. Okay, so let's just get our main buildings first, guys. So now we need the hatchery. So what you do is you go here, and we can build a hatchery there. We'll not rush it, guys, but take it easy. Take it easy. Argentina's still nil-nil for anyone who's interested. Argentina in Croatia, it's currently nil-nil. They only die after some time they're KO'd. Can either send them to prison or the graveyard, depending on what you've unlocked. Okay. Fireflies suck. You can get rid of units you don't want by dropping them back into the portals. Really? Really? So if I, uh, if I got rid of a firefly, I'd get like a goblin, or a goblin will come out? Is that what happened, John? Spells, and get more imps. Let's get another imp. Help speed the process of things up. Right, okay, that's nice. I guess I, I, could, I could set my hockeys like I have in Populous, very similar to what I have in, uh, in Dungeon Keeper 2. Uh, all the way around. Vice versa. What I was trying to say, you know what I'm trying to say. Okay. Library. Training room. Ah, oh, there's the treasury. Okay, there's the treasury. We finally get the treasury and the workshop. Okay. Ah, oh, there's the music. There's the music. Right, we've got gold here. To get a library, it's 600 per, per block. We can, we can take this gold here. And then we'll build where the gold was. Is it worth slapping your imps? Like, do they work that much? Is it such a big increase? I mean, there's numbers above their names. I'm not sure what that means. Is that their level? How good they are? Job, idle, mining. And we can see our idle men here, so we currently have an idle imp. No, okay. So they're taking the gold they just found, they're taking it back to the treasury. Ah, there's the music, guys. We can hear it, finally. Recall. Your dungeon heart will only hold a sum of 16,000 gold, so build a treasury. Okay, so we need a treasury now to get more gold. Now, what I did in the first game, I just built like a treasury around... What's going on? Your dungeon has been breached. My dungeon's been breached? By what? By what? 
What have we been breached by? What's happened? Alright, I don't know what's going on, but my men are, are uncovering new things, so whatever. Must have, maybe did we kill something really quick? I don't even know. I don't even know. So what I did in the first game, I was saying, I... Can I do this? Can I chop these down? Because these are just unnecessarily large blocks. Let's chop these there. Uh, let's cut these down. We'll make this our treasury as well. We'll expand our treasury just around our heart. So we've just uncovered... Alright, okay, this is their stronghold. What are these? Well, our, our guys are scouting and getting killed by cannons. They've got cannons, guys. They've got cannons. What's this thing? Dispels the fog of water, expose secrets of the entire realm. Reveal map. Alright. How do I get that? Do I send a man there? I guess so. Alright. Go for the library. Alright, there's our library. It should bring some warlocks to the realm. Alright, now let's get our treasury expand around here. This is, what I, this is what I was going for, guys. Treasury around the heart. Gonna build there as well. Oh, I can build through here? No, I can't. There we go. So we've got the treasury around the heart. That must be the wall that's just arrived. Yeah, there's the wall. Let's pick them up and send them over there quick. There you go, mate. Get stuck in there. Do some work. Now we should maybe get some more spells. Not right now. Let's get another imp. How much are imps and costing right now? 700, 7,500. Ah, it costs mana to get imps. It doesn't cost uh, gold. I thought it was gold the last game. I was like, what? My gold's not going down. But that explains it. That explains it. Okay, I'm going to right click these messages as well. That's good. Right, we're getting used to the we're getting used to the mechanics of the game, guys. All right, let's go this way now, and we'll try and get a big, big training room. Huge train. What's this? Zoom to battle. Oh, who's this guy? Who's he? He looks a bit creepy, doesn't he? Look at him sneaking along there. Was he meant to be some sort of wannabe ninja, wannabe assassin? Look at him. Where's he gone? Let's get my Warlock over here and try and help. Come on, Warlock. Warlock, get up and hit him. Right, we're our Warlock's actually taking a bit of damage. Let's see if we can cast a Thunderbolt on this guy, keep him alive. There we go, we knocked him down. Did our Warlock die? No, he's been knocked down. This guy's quite strong. Our Imps don't attack. Fireflies are pretty useful. This guy's like, okay, so he's knocked out. He's not dead. So that guy's knocked out as well. Right. Imps regenerate health, so you can slap as much as you want. Can you possess minions in this game? I haven't seen the ability to yet, James. Doesn't seem like it. Right, where's the trading room I was trying to build? Right, can we guys get this uh, built? Have we got any idle men? I do. Get my idle imps over here to claim this territory. We might need to expand our lair because we're getting more men. I just clicked there. Why didn't you let me? Thank you. Training room. That's a big training room, guys. Look at that. Right. Let's get one warlock to train him up. We'll train one warlock up and the other one can study. Is it, is it necessary to study? There's no more spells even to get, so let's just get both warlocks here. There we go. So by mining the gold, we can win the level. Let's check out M. Right, it's not. There's gold here. And here. 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 Is that it? Is that all the gold in the game? Our fireflies are getting. You could be right, uh, uh, John. Let's get rid of these. Oh, they go back down the bottom. Five Eyes of Dungeon, right. Interesting. Interesting. So now we also need to get the, the workshop, which is like the goal. Sort of have a goal here to get a workshop.
Fog of War. That's not Fog of War. I can see it. Let's build our workshop. What does this workshop do? It gives us trolls who can uh, who can build for us. Is that how it works? Build doors and reinforcements. Maybe we shouldn't get this. Maybe we shouldn't dig through here yet until we can build doors. And I guess this is a door. It says it's fog of war, but I can see it. I can see it. Still no, no, the Argentina Croatia game. Let's start building the workshop. Our gold went negative. Why is it doing that? Is our our output or something? Is that a payday? Is it payday, guys? Is this why it's on minus four thousand four hundred eighty? Where's everyone going? Okay, they're taking the gold, are they? Right. Okay, let's get some imps and bring them over here. A oh, hell. Attracted by the splendor of your workshop, his craftsman skill are set to serve you well. Okay. As one whose toil will make both traps and doors for you to use in your defense. Do I need to command him to make the doors, or does he just do it himself? Become unhappy because he has no lair. It is payday. It is payday. Okay, I just heard that someone's unhappy because he's got no lair. So as I was thinking before, we do need to increase our lair. See the workshop panel. Then select the symbol for the sentry ah, trap. Okay, hang on, hang on. There's too much going on now. Unravel this, please. Unravel this. People are in. Uh, we've got a fight going on and everything. There's a fight going on and everything. Oh hell! Some serious fighting going on here. Guys. We've got a lot of mana though. We can, we can slow them down. Knock them back, knock them back, right. Have we got any f we've got no goblins, oh we do, we have four. Let's see if our troll can fight as well, let's get our men here. Right, let's see if they can fight, come on, let's do this. Let's zoom in, see how this battle goes for us. I think we've got the numbers, <laughs> I think we've got the numbers. It's like these ninja assassins again trying to get into our base, but it's not working out too well for them. My wife just went crazy on the on the on the on the uh, on the on the couch there. It looks like Croatia scored, but I don't think he did. No. She got so excited that the the TV went off for a second. Ah, <laughs> uh, World Cup season, World Cup season, guys. I don't know what happened. I have no idea. Let's <laughs> let's expand the air uh, the workshop here. Right, what did it say? I mean, I've lost the message. Okay, I've got a new toolbar. This will be it. Workshop items: a sentry trap and a wooden door. I'm sure you guys might have told me this. You can possess units in this game. You get to spend the next level. Okay. All right. So it seems like there's a, there's a lot to learn. All right. Now watch. Now watch. Trolls will fabricate the trap. Then imps will take it to its designated place. You thieving keeper! I will punish you for daring to despoil my land. Oh hell! Now watch. The trolls will fabricate the trap. Then imps will take it to its dedicated place. So they make the trap in here. Right. Okay. We're under attack, guys. Let's get a door. Place well your wooden doors in Quick door. To slow down hostile enemies. Door. Sentry traps. We're getting attacked. They're coming for us. We took all the gold on the land, so they're coming for us. Because it has no lair. What are they doing over there? Okay. People are still unhappy that there's no lair. Right. I said I was building that lair ages ago, but I completely forgot. I have a lot of mana. New spells? No. Does possessing a creature in this game um, do anything for you other than just being a fancy new thing? Because uh, in the last game it didn't really achieve much. I mean, it was cool to look at, but it didn't really achieve much. In fact, I could probably just make a square. Okay, I know I know how to do this, guys. We know what I'm doing. Okay, the door hasn't been built. It's just walking straight through. Okay, we're under attack. Uh, the sentry traps haven't been done. Uh, we're going to die. It's game over. Let's cast a spell. Just cast them on, the, on all. I've got loads of mana. Right, these guys are busy trading up while we're under attack. So, uh, maybe, guys, can I select everyone with, with like shift or something? No, no, I can't. They're gonna attack my heart. They're gonna attack my heart, guys. 
Send that one in. Your destiny is to die by my sword, I think he said. I think he said the guy is actually taunting us. Yeah, yeah, okay. Let's have a look now. Let's have a look. Alright, I think we've won, guys. Success, my Another portal gem is yours. Your wickedness it didn't seem too difficult. I thought it was going to be harder. We didn't have our traps up or anything. You can control units if you possess them. Yeah, we did that last week, but it didn't let you do anything. When units complain about not having a lair, it usually just means they haven't made a home yet. So a unit has to go to the lair and then make their own home? Is that how it works? Put a door on the other side of the portal where the water is and lock it will stop your imps from trying to claim where the enemy is. Alright. Interesting stuff, guys. Any ideas for the high score here? I'm guessing we didn't get any special rewards either. I press space and it's gone black. All change. All change. Who's this? What 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 cinematic am I getting now? That's my warlock. Alright. So is there going to be a spell later in the game where we can Come turn enemies into chickens? Whatever will you think of next, Keeper? The sunlit kingdom of the heroes draws a little closer with each victory. And this was cleverly fought. Well done. Lord Avaricious Thanks. lies broken before you with his gold in your coffers. Who says you can't buy happiness? Who says you can't buy happiness, guys? Fifth place we came, level three. Okay, so these are the scores for, like, the default scores. I guess these probably are people who were in, involved in the creation of the game. Alex Peters. David Foskett. Boat Lover. Boat Lover had a, a good influence, like. You can do combat and dig when you possess. Yeah, but you don't need to, do you? you you're much better off managing the the units in the base from above, right? Surely. It's better than just being confined to the one person's visions and one person's actions. One person's actions. Body McBoat face. That's, yeah. I don't know how... Is Bud Mc with the M? Oh no. Obviously with an M, but with an A. How big can I make it? Oh, right. Sorry, Nick. Oh, Christ. Hang on. We'll have to get rid of the space. Body Mc Boat Face. There we go. Nice. Level 4 now, guys. This is about the last one. I can't, we've got through more than we had in the last one. Uh, still no the Argentina and Croatia. I'll be watching the second half of that. My wife sat here with like a sheet over her. Like she's like a 90 year old woman. He's currently patrolling his keep, considering himself Snipers. and all of his subjects safe in this land. Known as a cowardly wretch, he has always relied on others to do his fighting for him. This is one battle he will not avoid. This is one battle he will not avoid. Traverse the moat of Lord Ludwig's fort and wrestle the, wrestle the portal gem from him. Find and claim the guard rooms. Lead a charge of grouped creatures into Ludwig's fort. Find and claim guard rooms. All right, let's have a look. Lord Ludwig knows your intentions, evil keeper. But Mark, he towers in his castle, not to weigh behind what he supposes is the safety of the drawbridge now destroyed by his own hand. From here, he has entrusted your destruction to his goodly warriors, whom he feels are more than equal to the task. For our part, we must know that they and he will perish, slain by forces under your command. You damn right they will, guys. You damn right they will. Right. There's gold on this side, there's gold everywhere. There is gold everywhere. Alright, let's kinda of zoom out a bit because it's a bit zoomed in right now. There we go. Right. That's so the objective is to traverse the mort, and the mort was well like okay, this is all fog. That's my portal. You gotta get through the gold to get to the portal, guys. The lair here. 
It's going to be an expensive lair. We need to get some treasure. And let's pick up one guy. Send him over here. Come on, do a bit of that. You guys, I would prefer you to claim this territory, please. No, it looks like they want to go with gold regardless of what I do. Right, that guy's doing it. These guys are getting the gold. Let's slap them a little bit. Thank you. Work up. Work up. Speed up. Work harder. There we go. Slap them all. Slap them all. I'm like the Mad King from uh, Game of Thrones, but it's not burn them all, it's slap them all. Come on, hop to it. Let's go. Right. Layers. There we go. Right. We've got a lair. Next thing is a hatchery to feed our men. And I guess we can go like this. Why not? There we go. Slap, slap, slap. And let's get some more gold. Slap. And can we get another imp? And then it's 3,000. Yeah, okay. Two more imps. Cost of business mana. Our mana's going up slightly. We've got 82 increase in mana and 42 uh, output there. So that's okay. That's okay. I presume this is the normal build order of Dungeon Keepers. There's the lair and then the hatchery and then things like that. And then the library to research. Don't really know, guys. Don't really know. Maybe an early library is good to get more research points. Of course, we do need to get to the to here to get some warlocks. Which we will do very, very shortly. Our gold's going up there. Plenty of gold now. Plenty of gold so we can get our hatchery. Is it worthwhile building like a hatchery in this, this section as well? Or should you keep corridors like unoccupied? We're just clicking. Every time a new territory gets uh, claimed, we can just click. There we go. And then the library's next. Okay. Nice big library over there for our warlocks. Let's chop through here. Slap him and then he should just cut it, I think. Yep, there he goes. Nice, we're in here. So he's gonna, gonna go claim it now. Where's he going? Hey! Hey! Yeah, go on. I want this portal. I want this... Oh, he's doing the wall instead. This guy's gonna get the portal for us. Okay. Lego Rock Raiders let you do that. Lego Rock Raiders? How many Lego games are there? Yeah, I, yeah, I, know, I know I need a treasury to claim gold. Come on, I'm not silly. So they chop the... the so the priority is to cut and then they'll claim the land, right? Or at least I would have thought... Where are they going now? I want the land claim. Can I just drop him here? Claim the land. Claim the land. Go on, work quicker. Should we get a training room or should we get the library first? Because the training room is good. For ah, fuck it. Let's go for the library. Let's go left to right. We'll go left to right, guys. It's going to be simple. There we go. That's our library. We should get some warlocks from the port now. Yep, our oh, warlocks are arriving now. There he is there, looking very uh, menacing, really. Gold? Oh, okay for gold. We're going to need a bit more to get the train room, though, so let's just uh, mine this one here. I'm clicking to mine. Thank you. Thank you. Right. And we can get some gold here as well. So we have the hatchery, we have the library, and spells-wise, we can get a new spell. I guess this is the possessed creature one. Thunderbolt we've got. We can get another imp to speed up everything. Uh, two more imps. Thank you. I think our lair is big enough to get to... Uh, capacity used. Two out of 15 bed spaces. Okay, well, that's, that's good. Uh, research is one out of seven. Shelf space filled. Zero out of eight. Library's owned one. Okay, the hatchery. Hatchery says... Hatchery's owned one, obviously. Drop a hungry minion on it to feed it. Okay, they, I guess they go there themselves and, and, and feed themselves. They don't need me to do that. Training room? Where should we get the training room? Observe the creature panel on your screen. Click on creatures numbers once or more to carry them, and drop them where you will, just as before. Nope. Observe also the symbols which lie beside. Use these to gauge your beast's activities. The number which now fight or work, and whether they remain free. What the hell is going on? The guard room. Drop your creatures here to keep them lively and alert. Then it's ready for the fight. Okay. 
the flashing area which surrounds it marks the zone where any brush with trouble by your creatures will give cause for them to dash back and report. Okay. So reinforcements can be found. Okay. Make sure there's adequate provision for your minions and wings nearby. Whether they are on guard, they still require their creature comforts. It's wise to minimize the time you stay in the Okay, so we should build like a lair and a hatchery next to our guard room here, I guess. I guess that's what he just indicated, so let's do that. Oh, hey, it's got smaller now. Guard room, you can build a guard room. Lair? Hatchery? Here. Yeah. Okay, right. I think that's what it wanted me to do. Okay, we can chop this one down as well. Can I? No, I can't chop that down. It's solid rock, it's dense. Oh. The dark end. Their sniping skills are sharp as bolted arrows that she shoots. She serves you well and lie behind your fighters and excels in GT as a guard. We've got a sniper, guys. We've got a sniper. A new spell. A new spell. Possession. Possession. Let's call Possess the Sniper. Cast on a given creature places you within its soul. Oh, hell. Your eyes behind its eyes. Oh. And makes its movement fully Oh, I went out. Control. Oh, well. It was brief. But we'll uh, maybe come back to that later. I don't think there's any point in doing it, to be honest. You guys maybe you tell me differently. I see you're adept at this new skill. So, time to try another. Grouping it. Grouping it enables you to band a number of beasts together in a group. To do it, first possess a creature and then select the group key. What's that? Then look through the creature's eyes which you possess. When you spy another left click on the mouse, all creatures must the group will follow you wherever you go. Alright, so you can sort of grab them all as you possess one and you get a group of men following you, you're like the leader of this this group, is that how it is? Did I get a train room? I didn't. Let's get a train room here. As these lands get cleaned, we will hit down the training room. There we go. Nice big training room. We're going to need some more gold now, though, because our gold's getting low. There's some gold here. There's a bit there. There's plenty here. We can go left from the portal and work our way around this way. We will need some treasuries, though, so let's whack down some treasuries. Uh, we can just put them anywhere, I guess. Do you, do, does it help to have treasuries in, like, a group of six guys? We could, I suppose we could put, like, a treasury here. I don't know if it helps to have like a, a 3x3 treasury or just stick them anywhere like I was doing previously. Tons of Lego games. Hmm. So we have to uncover guard rooms. That's the objective, right? Find and claim the guard rooms. Do you do that just by like digging? Just like digging out towards the fog? Hey, just, just dig towards the fog, guys, and see what... Is this dense? Yeah, I can't build that. Let's just build towards the fog. Can I actually click in the fog, or is that just a bit too bold? That's all dense. I can't build around that. Like, if I click here... Alright, we can. Nice. We'll, we'll see what's over there, guys. We'll see what's over there. So this is a... I can fly. This is a, a door of the enemy, I guess. So I guess to attack them, we need to get through there somehow. You'll create imp spell and be upgraded. My crit imp spell has been upgraded. We're under attack, guys. Okay, we're under attack. Guard room should be able to hold these off, you would think. Oh, they're actually digging away. That's cool. All right. Very nice. So this could be the treasury here. Oh, I guess we could go ahead for our... Uh, our workshop always makes a bit more sense. Insta workshop. Get some trolls now. We'll build some stuff for the trolls. Oh, fly. And I suppose we just slap down treasuries anyway, like this. Like, I suppose it doesn't really matter where you put the treasury. Anywhere to store gold. Can the enemy steal gold? Maybe. But maybe there's something for, like, more advanced levels a bit later on, you know. 
so our men are digging away. We're, we're, I haven't found anything though. Our spells upgraded. Grade two. Come on, guys. Help me dig through here. Oh, we found some water. Nice. Let's have a dig through here. Okay, well. You can order units for following your present seven. Is that what you said? If I possess someone. A new species of creature. Okay, our trolls just arrived, guys. So let's try and actually build some stuff this time. A wooden door. Into our, into our world. Build a wooden door here? No. Why not? Why not? Sentry trap? I just want to build a sentry trap here. How does that work? But I can't build a door there because maybe because it's against water. Build one there in front of there. Build one, build a door in front of their door? It's a bold move. Let's see if it pays off. So you've got the hatchery here. My Thunderbolt spell has been upgraded. Okay, nice. Hey, we claimed one, guys. We found one all the way over here. Nice, we uncovered it. Right. We're under attack again. Come on, guys. You should be okay up there. Get our elves over there to help out. I think that guy's just got ganked though. I think we just sort of brought someone away from someone who was, who was attacking and then... What's this? We attacked again? Right, maybe we can help him with the uh, Thunderbolt. There we go, we stunned them both. Should be enough to kill them. Come on! Can we possess one of them? Let's kill him. We got this. How do I attack? Attack! This is riveting stuff, guys. Oh, did we get him? So I press 7 here, is this guy following me? No? Alright. No? Okay. Like we're playing like a 1990s uh, RPG here. It's pretty cool. I wonder if there's like modifications of the game where this is like all you can do and you have to try and win like it's just like they turn it into some sort of FPS game right it must have been payday it must have been payday because our gold went down a bit I'm not 100% certain we found our guard room over here so to get over there easier we can just go straight through here we can chop these buildings down can't we yes yes we build some layers and hatcheries there I suppose okay now the door, we could build the door here then. No, because that's a treasure room. Damn it, Craig. It is payday. It is payday. Under attack again. Let's build a train room around here. Build a training room next to the uh Was that a training room? Did I build a train where's the where's like the, the panels and stuff? Does it not work like that? All these guys are knocked down. We're low on gold as well. Let's get some more imps. Right. Okay. <laughs> I feel like it's all got a bit out of my control now. And over here, did we found another guard room? We, we did, but we're under attack. Christ. So you can put these sentry traps down. Like here, I guess. Now we can expand our library. Although we're getting attacked right now, it's probably not the best thing to be expanding, but whatever. You no, we can't. Afford can't afford to. Our oh, imps are getting attacked, is that right? Can we get some men over here? What are these idle imps? Maybe they can help distract, get the warlocks. Get them to help as well. Okay, we got some more gold now, because we just mined some, so let's improve our library a little bit. Which one's the library? That's the one. Why are these doors getting built? Awaiting construction. Why are they awaiting construction? Where's my... Uh... 
Where are my trolls at? Have I got any trolls? This is the this is the storage room, right? Yeah, uh, the the workshop, right? I don't know how that works, guys. I think I'm starting to lose uh, patience. Like I don't know what's going on. That's for this guard room. Apparently, you should build things next to the guard room. So that's what I've done. They're fortifying all these walls. That okay, a sentry trap's been created. Right, okay, they finally built one. Right, okay. So then they're going to take the sentry trap to somewhere that needs it, which must be this here, right? Has he got it now? Okay, there it is. Nice, we've got our cannon. We have no gold. Another spell has been upgraded, guys. Nothing left, nothing left to research. Possession spell has been upgraded. How do you upgrade the possession spell? Most rooms require you to be three by three to have a train uh, to have a train dummy. All oh, right, okay, so that's where I went wrong. But I can't get rid of this here. Right. Okay, it looks like the first half of Argentina is finished, and it was nil nil, nil nil. Argentina really need to win if they want to uh, get through to the next round. Just saying. Lots of treasure rooms there. Very nice. They get we're getting attacked. How are they attacking us? Get over here and help out. And I guess we should build a door here. And a sentry trap? A sentry trap go behind or sentry trap what's a sentry trap do? Just take me this rain. So I put it in front of the door or behind the door? Why not both? Why not both, eh? It's like a trap, but it it looks more like a cannon. Rather than something that you have, to, you have to trigger. You know what I mean? That gate's still not being built. Oh, I'm getting not getting the hang of this. Can't, can't, oh, can I? Alright. Okay, I can't even get that. And I guess you can't cross the water. What else is on the map, guys? A sentry trap has been created in your world. So we found the guard rooms over here. There's some more gold over here. Does okay, that mean we can go and explore over this way? And likewise, I guess we can go and have a cheeky look over this way and see what's on the other side. We've got lots of gold now, guys. Tons of gold, actually. Tons of mana as well. Oh, mana's flying up. Guess we should get some more imps. There we go. This is our training room, right? Let's increase the size of our training room. What's under attack? My heart's under attack. Alright, okay. It's not the end of the world. Oh, you, c you can walk through the water? Oh, I'm learning new things, guys. I'm learning new things. I did not click all the way up there. Goblin has become unhappy or maybe I did earlier. The goblin's become because he hasn't been paid. Why not pay him? How do you is there a way I need to pay these guys? You upset my OCD with those squiggles and lack of swear rooms. If your trolls are already training, they tend not to make stuff in the workshop unless you tell them. Does that mean by telling them to get into the training, into the room? I see you have discovered a magical item. Have I? Ooh, what's this? We found something. Your creatures have been blessed with experience. Ooh, we found like a relic. What's this thing? I want it. A hero gate. Heroes may invade the only one for this entrance. Alright. That's where the enemy comes from. Maybe I don't want it. Lead a charge of grouped creatures into Ludwig's. So I need to group the creatures, guys. Okay, so how do I do that again? Find and claim the guard rooms. Is there any more guard rooms? I don't know. Might be some more over this way, maybe. Got our, we didn't build our. What happened to our gate we were building? Can't build it anymore now. That's a shame. Right. What's all this I made? Training room stuff. 
training room here. A nice big training room. And this was for my workshop, right? Does this entice more trolls to come? I don't really know how it works, guys. Oh, oh, don't want that guy. Right, lots of imps. Just drop all the creatures at the door. Alright, okay. When we're ready to attack, we drop all the creatures at the door, we storm in and kill the enemy. Maybe we should train our we sh we should train our army up before we go for the attack. A wooden door has been created in your way. Everyone get in the train room. Imps as well. Oh no, you ran away. <laughs> there wasn't any of it. Oh look at all them imps going to work on this place. Let's slap them all. Oof. I preferred the slapping in the first game, I think. Now, I made all this land for a reason. I think I made it to get a big lair. I don't think I need a lair, but I'm going to get one anyway, because why the heck not? A humongous lair, guys, for everyone to rest. Look at that. Now they can't complain about them having no room. Okay. Are people are training up? This is a troll. If we send our troll back here, it should work, right? For some reason, I can't select the trolls. Oh, no, I can't. There we go. Right, okay. He's going to work in the workshop, okay? I hope. I hope. And then we're going to go for the final attack, and then we're going we're gonna to win this level. Oh, we're going to lose this level, won't we? We've got our sentry guns here. What if we just do this, right? Get a ton of sentry guns. When you have one troll... How do we only have one? I thought we had three. What happened? What went wrong? Now I, I can sell a sentry trap has been this here, right? In your workshop. And then we can increase our... Yeah, there we go. Now the trade room should be even bigger. Let's scroll around a bit. Yeah, lots of, tr locked, lots of practice dummies here, guys. Lots of practice dummies. We need some gold. We need some gold. Is that a big enough trade room, Nick? Is that alright? Is that okay? Hope so. Guard room. Lots of sentry guns. Got a gate over there. Let's just sell this one. There's no one coming here anyway. Sell it for half the cost. That's not a good uh, a good way of playing the game. I sort of uh, messed up a bit there, didn't I? Hero gates. The goblin has become angry because he hasn't been paid. Goblin's become angry because he hasn't been... Oh, we're low, on, uh, we're low on gold. I guess if payday comes, they're going to get unhappy. That makes sense. A sentry trap has been created in your workshop. Right, look at all this stuff here. Look at that. There we go. Minus 7,220. Oof. Where's all my uh, goblins at? Everyone, over here. Mind me some gold. And then we'll slap them all to speed up the process. It's payday. It's payday and we've got no gold. Everyone's going to get angry and probably going to leave my army. My phone battery is about to run out. Take this gold back, guys. Take the gold back. I think we're going to go for an attack now, guys. I think we've got some gold now. Everyone should be getting paid. I think it's time to go for an attack. Oh. Oh. Right, come on, let's go for an attack, guys. Let's do this. Let's forget these last two sentries. We'll sell them back. And then we'll grab all our men. And we'll send them here. Right, again. Let's go. You're going to attack the gate? Okay, here they go. Attack the gate. The gate's been attacked. Let's possess one and see what's going on from like live action. Bah. Let's go. Come on. Get this big guy. Your creatures are free to hear their master. Whoa. I'm guessing all I can do is just press the left mouse button, and that's about it. Nothing overly. Oh, he died. Okay, let's head back out. 
Oh. Oh. Okay, that was intense. Oh, there's another relic thing over here. What's going on? Oh, I possessed someone else. Can I go over here and get this relic? Give me it. Give me it. Can I jump? No, it's not that advanced. <laughs> right, okay. Our imps can come over here and help out. Not taking over an enemy portal. Rejoice. A second portal is now claimed. A second portal is now claimed. Prepare as it. As from it, five more creatures will be drawn to your dungeon. Oh, so the more po the more okay. So the more portals you claim, the more uh, men you get. Is that how it works? So there must be portals all over the map. I guess you just keep pushing forwards. I see you have discovered a magical item. I have. What did you do? What did it give me? Doesn't tell me, guys. This is a longer level. Now, where do I need to go? This is all land we can't get past. All this land we can't excavate. So, what are we supposed to do? Maybe just get the, the gold? How do you get this gold? Can they walk across the water? It looks like they can, actually. Okay, so maybe they can walk across the water anyway, and we just we can go like right. Okay. Oh Jesus! Look at all the gold. Okay, so they can't. They can. They can pass through the water, guys. I thought they couldn't. Does that mean there's like other pathways I've just been ignoring? Because I've seen water, like up here. Okay, no, these these guys. You can't go any further here. Right. So we must have to go north ways. That's just more gold. There's nothing else there. Have I got all the buildings? Yeah, I believe so. Where do I go, guys? Where do I go? Where's this fort? We need to find our way in, do we? Do this gold? go this way can we it looks like maybe that's the way to go it's like all the idle men get them over here slap them a bit hello Mahmood the imps will take your magic items to the library okay so we look in the library and then it should tell us what there is all right uh, where is it I guess it's these books is it it doesn't really tell us what it is Conjures up a workforce of magical drones. Alright. Okay. Now, if we build treasuries here, maybe they'll take the gold straight here so they don't run all the way back to the base. Like like that. Oh, we're in the second half of the football now. Guys, didn't you get this game over with? Gotta go and watch the football. So just keep building uh, treasuries as we make our way through. There we go. Everything's a treasury. Look at the gold count going up. Look at the mana count going up. Okay, I think we found a way through, guys. I think we've done it. Aha. Haha. So it's just all about exploring. It's all about exploring and digging your way through. Digging your way through. And this fly's been around me all game. Come on, guys. Keep digging away. What's that? Oh, all right. Hello. Behold, Lord Ludwig's old decrepit servant Bob, who's left on guard alone. Disturb him, then he'll call his comrades. It would be best if he stayed quiet. But that's a dark elf. Use her eyesight. Zoom your vision to the target. Once you have him, shoot and kill. What? Sure, that'll keep him quiet. A warlock has become unhappy because he hasn't been paid. What? Right. Fikes? What's this? Receive imps. You have been blessed with extra imps. Alright, that must be one of the things. So, they want me to... aim my shot somehow. How do I aim my shot here?
How do I select the other? There's an, there's two there's two icons on the top there. How do I select them? Press Control. Press Shift or something. Press two. Ah, two. Okay, there we go. Two's changed it over. There he is. Like he's highlighted now. A troll has become we got him. No we got him. Right. Okay. And. <laughs> And then do we just select everyone? Your creatures are unable to get to Attack! Attack! This way! This way! This way! Now it did say to possess people somehow and I can group everyone. How do I do that? Come with me! Come with me people! To war. Is this working? I'm pressing 7 like you said, Jordan. I don't know if this is working. Let's go on myself. I'll do it alone. Your portals have attracted Nothing's happening. Okay, I've got different abilities I can press. 1, 2. Alright, nice. Okay. So 1 is my arrow shot. Uh, 2 is like a single arrow. And three is like a, a stealthy blade. I guess you learn, you get new abilities from leveling up. To group the strongest forces in a battle and only then... Oh, we made it through the door. And that's their fortress, guys. Okay. Okay. Everyone's leaving, though. Why are they... Why has they got no layers? So there's the main guy. How do we cross there? We just have to group everyone and go across, like I just did. Come on, guys, come back with me. No? Alright, let's, let's try that again. I don't know what it did, but it seemed to group everyone together. So let's just grab everyone. Like so. Knock them all down. And then possess them. And then hopefully they all come with me. Come on, guys, follow me. Follow me. I'm the boss. No? Where are you going? Get back here. A troll has become angry because he has. It's not working, John. They're not following me. Do I just like run across here? I'll do this on my own. I'm not scared. Okay, maybe I've angered them now. They're all going to attack me. I got dodging skills. Come on, micro. In, out, in, out. Oh, dead. Okay. Well, that didn't work. How do I get them across? Croatia scored. Croatia scored. Croatia has scored against Argentina. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Guys, how do I make them attack? I'll press 7 and click them. Okay. Oh, Jesus. Argentina getting beat. This is not good. Right, here we go. Try this again. Okay, now press 7 and then click them. Right, okay. Here we go, guys. Everyone with me. A warlock has become angry because he hasn't been. They're not coming with me. Hey, you! I want to target this guy. This this is not in, in intuitive mind. Okay, this isn't working. What am I supposed to do to make them attack? There must be a better way than possessing creatures. How do I get my men to go across here, over to the enemy's fortress? Like I've got a, a little band here, but it's not really enough. Okay, I'm going to zoom out. I've, I've led, I've led some men there. But how do I get everyone just to go and attack? How do you force people to go somewhere and attack? 
Because naturally the enemy, the, you, you react to the enemy attacking you, you go and defend the position. But if, how do you go and tell them they're going to attack somewhere? People are leaving my dungeons because they're not getting what? I don't understand. Because he has no food. Because they have nowhere to live. God, all these people do is whine. All they do is whine. Yeah, I don't, I don't know how to attack, guys. Uh. A dark elf has become unhappy because she has no food. People become unhappy because they have no food. A new species of creature has entered your dungeon. A new species of creature? Oh, the firefly. Woo. Starting to get a bit, uh, a bit bored to be honest, guys. Don't know what, don't know what I'm supposed to do. People are getting unhappy, yada yada yada. Elves aren't claiming the territory like they should be. The imps or whatever. I think I prefer the original Dungeon Keep. I had more fun playing that. You're gonna do this. Jesus, come on, hurry up, hurry up. Is it big enough lair for you guys? Okay. <laughs> there are paths to the east and west. Okay, that makes more sense. Thanks, Jordan. You're right, why didn't I try and explore a little bit more? Maybe he'll attack me then if I go this way. I'm clicking to build, why doesn't he let me build? Right, can we get this built? I wanna go watch the football. Come on. Get over here and build this stuff. Come on. Come on. Slap them all for good measure. Oh, the cannonballs are attacking us. So am I supposed to build new stuff as I, like, progress? Okay, they're going to come and attack me this way. It looks like they're making some sort of move. We're reaching their base now. Is it a case of just, like, building and exploring all the time in Dungeon Keep? We should always be exploring. Like, excavating the whole thing. Okay, well now we're under attack. Let's get everyone over here. Finally! We found a way in. Can't get them over here. Right, guys, get up. Get up and attack. Right. We're learning things as we go. Path more. Explore more. There isn't always one way to get in. We won. <laughs> wow. You know, I might have enjoyed them off. I went for a second whiskey like last week. Well, guys, we won. Argentina's currently playing, so I want to go and watch the rest of the football with my wife. 